Okay, hey everybody, a little something different, just a little short, down here at the uh, Deer Preserve, it's uh, Wednesday evening, and we're going to see if we can sneak out here and see the kids while they're doing their thing. Yeah, I know it's not wrenching, but you know. Life's not always about wrenching. Sometimes it's about enjoying what you got. God has graced us with the presence of some incredible wildlife. Yeah, we feed them. It's cheaper than buying more ornamental plants because they are like, you put out a bunch of plants, it's salad bar, golden corral, Yeah, first buck that we've had come up. He's a young'un. Yeah, hey, baby. Yeah, this little girl right here, she's real curious. She keeps wanting to come up and see me, but she gets with it about six feet, and then she says, no, I'm not ready. At some point before I die, it'd be nice if I could, you know, pet him, feed him from my hand. Lord knows all the feed I've been giving him. Probably some of the best venison in the world. Hey, Bucky. Nope. How you doing? Do do do. What's up, Bucky? Huh? Yeah. You're spoiled. Just like all the rest of them. Hi, sweetie. Yeah, folks, down here at uh, the Deer Preserve in French with Grandpa, we don't just uh, clean and work on cars. We try to take care of our folks here in the neighborhood, mostly our wildlife. So, this was just kind of a quick interlude. We've got parts that have started showing up for the brake system, and so... Hopefully, come this weekend, we can do a big reveal, uh, box opening, and we can start getting a game plan together to get all of the old stuff ripped out. Master cylinders, lines, connectors, everything, and start rebuilding the wheels, the road, uh, drums, the pad, everything. All the parts are on the way. 
So, uh, hopefully, the next few videos are going to be more wrenching and me grunting and grinding and you guys getting to see us actually moving forward on some of the more important stuff here. So, stay tuned. Thank you, guys. Uh, thumbs up if you like the content, comments, and everything. Always appreciated. So please subscribe if you're not, because I just like to know you're out there and you appreciate what we're trying to do. So, let's see if these old kids are back out in the backyard again. Yep. You know, it's pathetic. I've got a lab who's like 15 years old. He's spoiled rotten. I've got a wife that I love dearly that I've had for mm, 33 years. I love her to death. She's probably spoiled, but, you know, I'm not going to say that because she's earned it. And God has been good. You know, sitting out here on the back patio in the evening or on the screen porch when it speaks... Uh, the mosquitoes are out, which, you know, they're starting to show up. Having a place to call home like this beats the hell out of therapy and living in an apartment in downtown. Hey, listen, y'all take care. God's blessings. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.